welcome to real civil youtube channel in the today's video we are going to discuss a very important topic from the field of concrete technology or we can say from repair and rehabilitation of concrete structures the topic is shotcrete so this topic uh, another name is granite shotcrete or granite these are the two popular names so these are the uh, these names represent the method for concrete repair okay so in short this method is pneumatically applied concrete or mortar pneumatically means uh, using compressed air we apply the concrete or mortar so this is the simple definition of shotcrete or granite so what we do in this method we basically deposit the material in layers over the surface under pressure without supporting formwork so this is very very advantageous thing that we don't require the formwork for this particular method of concreting so what we do we deposit the material in layers over the surface under the pressure without supporting the formwork so uh, it has wide application one of the application is uh, we need to uh, restore the spalled surfaces spalled surfaces means when the concrete is uh, like spalled out aggregates are come out reinforcement is exposed in those cases you can use this method okay so this method is basically divided into two types based on the process first one is the dry mix and second one is the wet mix so first we will discuss about the dry mix process so what we do so here we'll mix the dry materials first thoroughly so here i will go with side by side uh, two slides so this is the schematic representation so here you can see this is a concrete spraying machine and here we have to pour the dry mix dry mix means what whatever ingredients are there like cement is there sand is there okay so we put this in this machine okay so feeding of the materials in the mechanical feeder or the gun okay then carrying the material by compressed air through a hose to a special nozzle so whatever dry material is there with the help of compressed air through a hose or in simple word it is nothing but a pipe will be carried to a special nozzle so here you can see we put the dry mix and using the compressed air uh, we will carry this material through this hose or we can say pipe very important point introducing water at nozzle point and intimately mixing the water with other ingredients at the nozzle so here you can see this line is carrying the dry mix and this line is carrying the water so just before the release we introduce the water here so jetting the mixture from the nozzle at high velocity on the surface to receive the short grid so suppose here uh, whatever your surface is there so this material will be applied with pressure so that is the dry mix process where we add the water just before the nozzle and that velocity at which the material is applied for the dry mix it is around 90 to 120 meter per second so it is not the perfect value it is the approximate value at the nozzle end 
नोजल इज द पॉइंट थ्रू वेर द मटेरियल इज रिलीज सो हियर यू कैन सी अ पर्सन हू इज एप्लाइंग द मटेरियल विथ हाई प्रेशर एंड यू कैन सी देर इज नो एनी फॉर्म वर्क बेसिकली सो दैट इज द बिगेस्ट एडवांटेज ओके नाउ लेट्स डिस्कस द वेट मिक्स प्रोसेस सो वॉट वी डू इन द वेट मिक्स प्रोसेस हाउ इट इज डिफरेंट फ्रॉम द ड्राई मिक्स so in the dry mix we first mix the dry material and then it is carried out by the compressed air through a hose and then just before the delivery we were adding the water here okay so in the wet mix process mixing all the ingredient including the water so here you can see the dry material also water is added at the same time then feeding the mixture into delivery equipment so whatever material is there it will be feed into delivery equipment then this is this will be carried out and this will be sprayed on uh, where you want to repair the part okay so again delivering the mixture by compressed air up to the nozzle and then jetting the mixture from the nozzle at high velocity on the surface to receive the short grid so the important point is high velocity we apply the material with high velocity so here you can see the schematic diagram so basic difference is when you add the water if you add the water just before the delivery it will be dry mix and if you add the water at the beginning then it will be wet mix process now very important what are the advantages of short crit so very important short crit undergoes placement and compaction simultaneously as we are applying the material with high velocity so whatever placement and compaction is uh, happening at the same time okay so there is no need for vibrator and all those things second dense homogeneous high strength and waterproof layer we are getting in this case the very very important advantage is it can be applied on any type any shape of the surface the surface may be vertical it may be horizontal or it may be curved and why because we don't need to prepare the form work that's why you can apply on any surface and when you place because of high velocity it gets compacted also okay so we can apply it on any surface additionally you can add the fibers also in the ingredient so that you can improve uh, their properties so i hope the topic is clear short crit which is also called as gunite or we can say simple definition pneumatically applied concrete or mortar okay thank you please like share subscribe the channel if you have any doubt you can ask me in the comment box uh, I will reply. Thank you.